I really want to know how to use this one. Is it a poking method? Is it a, is it a smoothing method? Does it go up your nose method? Let's try. Yes, it fits. Hey, what's up? I'm Bella Thorne, and today I'm gonna be a guest correspondent for Wired. I'm gonna be reviewing some fashion and beauty tech. Already, first gadget. Let's see it. Oh boy, I know what these are. Oh, I remember when these were the craze and everyone was like, oh my God, have you seen this Snapchat glasses? It's so f cool, I can record you while just wearing glasses. Look at me, you can't even tell I'm recording you. But it's like, obviously you're recording this blinking light over here. All right, let's read some of these reviews. I wanna see what people are saying. If you're an avid Snapchat user, such as myself, then these things will be a perfect gift for you. My few gripes are that battery life is frankly terrible and these are way too pricey. He gives it four stars. What? Four stars out of five without review? I just don't know about those numbers. I don't think that adds up. These glasses have pretty bad pairing issues. I can see that. They did not pair with this. For $200, I shouldn't have to be troubleshooting these things every time I wanna upload a video. One star from Gerald. By the way, for everyone who says I can't read, hello. Did you guys see me read this for the first time out loud? I really wanna see if they actually work though because I remember when I went to the Snapchat offices and they gave me a pair, I tried it and it didn't work. And I was like, well, this is pointless. I don't understand. Like, what, what, what is happening here? Like, uh, did it record it? Did it work? Does anybody know how these things work? Anyone? Because I surely don't. Definitely the style of the glasses is better than the first model. At least these look a bit more low key. The other ones that I saw, if I remember correctly, had like yellow and black and really obvious. Yeah, I give this product zero stars because the lights turned on. I think that's about all the glasses do. Well, it feels cheap and flimsy. I'm assuming it's supposed to go like this. Well, definitely some stimulation for the brain. I'm just feeling really X-Men vibes with this. Muse 2 makes meditation easy by giving you real life feedback on your mind and body to help you recognize calm and stay in the zone. Immersive soundscapes respond in real time to your brain activity, heart rate, body movements, and breathing. This feedback guides your wandering mind to a focused and calm state. Would highly recommend anyone looking to start meditation or who is looking to go deeper in a meditation practice. Five stars from Andrew. Buggy and not worth the money. I bought this to relax and now I am more stressed out about wasting my money. One star from John. This does go on your forehead. So this goes around the back of the ears. I can try and hold it. Yeah. It says to make sure I'm wearing the headband properly, but I'm, I'm clearly not. Muse's sensors allow you to discover your mind and body in a completely unique way. I Through powerful real-time feedback, Muse will help guide you to a deeper understanding of yourself and your practice. Place the rubber ear sensors. Um, I learned a lot and connected very deeply with my inner self and my inner self says I hate meditation. The voice itself was a little annoying and I just don't know if I'd be able to meditate with that voice instructing me what to do. He would drive me a little crazy. I know that my fiance is really big in meditation and I'm sure he'd look at that as a piece of So, out of five stars, I would give this product one star because at least they had the app part of it working. Ooh, Dyson hair wrap. I got one of these upstairs that I've never used because I don't know how and it looks too confusing. Oh, this looks like a huge vibrator. F yeah. Interesting, I wonder what all these guys do. Oh, liking this. This is good. Not so much. What? <gasps> what are you? Uh, like <laughs> Dyson Air Wrap Styler. No clamping mechanisms or gloves, just voluminous curls in waves. Intelligent heat control measures hair temperature over 40 times a second to prevent extreme heat damage while styling. Amazon customer, 
It is absolutely the most wonderful, amazing, fabulous hair styling blow dryer. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. No, I'm serious. All those love it's are in there. Don't waste your money if you have long hair. It don't curl very well and it don't last. Two stars from Kim. There's a lot of heat coming off. Feels like a blow dryer almost, to be honest. No. So it uses like airflow to get the hair around, but all you do is just like. And you put it at the end over okay. the thing. Uh -huh. And then you see how it wraps there? And now you got a curl right there. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And you, you wrap. Yeah, and then put. Yeah, I'm just not gonna spend this much time trying to like get this thing working in the morning. I guess that, that made a nice wave. Very bouncy. So then now that just becomes a blow dryer. Is that it? All right, I'm gonna give this one like, I guess four stars because the way that the package comes together, they did a nice job as far as how it feels, how it looks, it feels expensive, it feels well done. Would I ever use it? No, probably not. It would probably be too hard, too much work for me to figure out in the morning. If I'm even going to curl my hair, you better know that I am not spending an extra 30 minutes being like, I'm so confused, why won't it wrap? Uh, yeah, that won't be me. I like the feeling. I don't know what you would call this. Silicone rubbery little guy. Let's see what he looks like if I take off his skin. Huh, oh look, what's happening here? Now it's 75. The first social network for girls who code. A magic charm is a wearable accessory designed for girls to customize directly from their mobile phones using programming. Great way for a student to learn coding. Plus, they get to wear the charm. Five stars from Dina. Look at what she wrote for the caption here. Easy coding, fun! Explanation point, I cannot. Like, this is definitely the company writing this as a comment. My nine-year-old figured it out very quickly and then got bored of it. She only played with it for a few days, two stars. And then there's animations up here. I'm sorry, you had to learn how to do all this just for this video? Yes. It's, oh no. I don't know, man. I know nothing about coding. Uh, watermelon getting eaten piece by piece like my brain is right now. You know, at least they got their app working and stuff. I'm gonna give it uh, a three out of five. Maybe some little girl out there really does want to use that piece of it. Well, it's a high frequency skin therapy wand with six infusion applications. Yep, that's what it says on the box. Need support? Stop. <laughs> Oh, it's a high frequency device. You know, when you see those videos of the girls and they've got that like weird clothy looking white thing. And then they have this guy they usually use for it. Where is he? Like this type of looking thing. And you know, they like go over it and it makes a sound. Jane Fonda uses a lot of high frequency stuff and that has kept her looking amazing. So it should keep us looking amazing. With aging, everything likes to drop, right? Cause you're working against gravity here, okay? And there is no really working against gravity. Okay, so what this does, I guess, is it takes all the little like fat pockets and uh, what's it called? Like your muscle pockets, these ones. It's supposed to help like stimulating all the pads in your face to kind of stay where they are in a way. I don't really know if it works, but all the Instagram girls love this shit. And Jane Fonda. Oh, to, for the scalp? To energize the hair follicles? Oh, promotes blood circulation. I would use this. I've been trying to grow this hair out for such a good minute and it just keeps staying at this godforsaken middle length.
High frequency sessions energize and oxygenate the skin to increase cellular activity. With regular use, you'll notice the reduced appearance of fine lines and wrinkles over time. The Y shape is used for the neck and the arms and legs or other areas that, are you ready for this? That it can be put in between. <laughs> Come on. But honestly, I would really like to work on this double chin I've been seeing for the past few months. And this, I feel like it's 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 happening for it, right? How much would you guess that I'm assuming it's in the 200 price range. Yeah. Bucks. What? All right, well, now we know it definitely doesn't work. Yes, you want to buy this. I used to work in spa and used a medical grade high frequency machine, and this is the same quality for $45. Must have five stars from JJ Nice. I bought it once. Two pieces didn't work and returned it and got a new one. One of those same two pieces still doesn't work. One star from Chester Maniac. I haven't used this, but uh, you know, I'm gonna give this one a good full five stars, okay? It probably works you know, ish. And I think people should use it because why would you have to go spend a thousand dollars a session just to get some 15 minute high frequency on your face? Who has the money to keep up with that? Like, no, no one's doing that. That's too much work. I probably wouldn't use this also a little bit too much work for me, but I'm gonna have to get those fat pads to stay up some way. I am a gadget bitch. I love gadgets. I love fun things to try and see if they work, see if they don't. So I had a lot of fun, but I would say if you're going Christmas shopping, do not buy any of these things. If you're gonna get them, get a gift receipt. 